There he is, Romain Saladini, 20 years of age from France. The number one seed after the qualification round. He's blowing hot in the competition. Right alongside him, the main man himself, Brian Lopes. 36 yesterday. Comes from California, former world champion. And Roger Rindenick from Switzerland, the bronze medal winner last year. And uh, on the outside, fourth rider will be Jorg Meyer of the Netherlands. It's definitely going to be a, a good one, Hugh. These are all good gate starters, and uh, there's going to be some elbowing down that first straight. Let's see whether Lopes can make up for the poor start in the semi-final. He's got to get it together here this time. They're ready. This is the men's final. Lopes is in lane two here, and he's had his better starts from lane two tonight. On his inside. Here they go, then. Who got the better snap out of the gate? He's got a great start, and Rindenek, but Lopes got the power down on that first straight. Lopes then moves his to the head of the race. Oh, crash. what a crash! It's Rindenek that's gone down, and Meyer of the Netherlands has crashed as well. Well, this leaves Lopes with the head of the field. If Lopes just takes a look back and see what a lead he's got, and he just needs to go for it. Lopes then marching on down the course now. It'll be a popular victory. Brian Lopes, the 36 year old Californian, heading on for another world title. Saladini of Francis Lopes second i'm waiting to see who's recovered then to try and get the bronze but lopes now lopes just showing up for the crowd a little bit there that was excellent look you didn't do what graves did got a showboat in lopes has got it he points Yay. to the sky lopes is the winner and takes the gold medal second place saladini of france and it looks like Meyer of the netherlands coming through for bronze and uh, fourth is rindenecht and that is confirmed i should have put my money on him you called him at the start, so the winner celebrating here, the world champion and gold medal winner is Brian Lopes of the United States, Romain Saladini of France takes silver, York Meyer of the Netherlands gets the bronze, and Roger Rindenek, the bronze medal winner last year, finishes fourth. What a race. That's put a smile on my face, Hugh. <laughs> there was no Brits in the final, so he was my next best. It's an American double then. Lopes wins the men's and Kintner wins the women's. I tell you what, they're dominant when it comes to four cross racing. Yeah, they've got that down. He's the race again, Steve. It is. Lopes didn't quite get that first pedal in, but it look, just looked like Saladini got dragged back a little bit, so it gave Lopes a small gap going into that first turn. He went for it, and the other guys just got hooked up. Saladini had to go a little bit straight, and Rindenek just rode into the back wheel of Saladini. Meyer couldn't go anywhere, he just hit Saladini's bike. They went a real box of tricks, didn't they, Rindenek and Meyer? They had, they had nowhere to go, there was a bike in front of them, and that's all they could hit. And of course, after that, it was all academic. Lopes was never going to surrender the front there. No way, you can see him putting the power down and just making sure he stays in front. And he can pick the right line, he's got nobody about him. That's exactly what he did, Lopes. Here he comes. Just cruised to the line. Did a bit of showboating on the way as well. Look at the smile. He knows he's got it. What a feeling. <laughs>